Hey guys, Mr. Cavan is here. I hope you're doing well. I hope you're at home washing your hands frequently uh, and being safe. Um, I don't have much to share yet, but I just wanted to give you uh, a quick video just to let you know that I am here in my classroom. I am working on a plan and there's a lot of unanswered questions at this point, but I'd like to share with you what little bit I do know. Uh, first of all, uh, as we continue to move forward, as always, the best way for you to uh, stay in contact with me if you have a question that you think I might know the answer to is just to use my school email. It's there on the screen. Same with parents. Encourage your parents to contact me through email if they have questions. Uh, but as I'll say probably several times uh, today, be patient. There's a lot, a lot that we don't know the answer to yet. We're waiting to hear more from the district. In the meantime, I'm going to try to put together some lessons to uh, <clears throat> to send out to you, and I will continue to use Google Classroom as my main platform for uh, posting assignments and receiving work from you. Uh, I will also contend, uh, continue to heavily rely upon Remind, so I'm grateful to those of you who have signed up for Remind, which I think is most of you, um, if not. Uh, if you'll go back into Google Classroom and if you scroll way back to like the very first day of the semester uh, in January, you'll see the instructions for how to sign up for Remind. Uh, I know I did that for fourth period. AP Bio students, I'm not sure, but your friends can tell you how to connect with Remind if you have forgotten how to do that. Um, I know we're going to have a few folks who do not have digital access, do not have internet, do not have reliable Wi-Fi. We are working on a plan for that. For my regular bio kids, fourth block, um, at the very least, I'll have some assignments that you can do out of your coach workbooks, and we'll have a plan for you coming to get those if you need to get those. But I'm going to try as much as possible to post things digitally on Google Classroom um, so that you can watch the lessons, answer questions. There may be some short quizzes here and there, especially AP Biology. Um, I'll say more about this later, but I'm, I'm going to try to post notes, video lectures, or at least PowerPoints with my voice talking uh, over the top, um, and then short quizzes uh, that go with each lesson. I think that's going to be the plan rather than trying to do a full unit and then a unit test. It'll be more uh, one day's worth of material, maybe a 15 to 30 minute lesson, and then here's a 10 question quiz. Um, that may change, so stay tuned. This is an evolving plan. So speaking of that, for now, for the short term, maybe even starting this afternoon, uh, it, I'm going to try to post uh, something on Google Classroom, uh, a PowerPoint with me talking. Um, we're getting ready to start our new unit on DNA uh, for AP Biology, um, so it'll be some review from last semester, but it'll be some things that also that you haven't heard before about how genes work at the molecular level. So I'll try to post notes. I'll ask you that you, that you watch those video lessons. Um, and then probably there will be uh, some sort of quiz to follow, either on quizzes or SchoolNet. I'm still working on that plan. But um, also reading assignments will continue. I think I had already posted a week's worth of reading assignments. I know you've got your textbooks at home. So where possible, I'll scan the pages like I've been doing, but since you're at home anyway, you can just read from the textbook. And um, I'll try to keep, continue posting those daily or almost daily reading assignments. Um, I know you guys are busy and some of you are babysitting and, you know, I'm going to try not to overload you, but at the same time, we are going to try to keep going. For fourth block biology, kind of the same thing. Um, I may use Edpuzzle a, a good bit. We practiced that a little bit last Friday. So there may be some Edpuzzles for you to watch and questions to answer um, that I can use as kind of classwork grade, formative assessments. Uh, I'll be posting assignments on Google Classroom. So get in the habit of checking that each day. And all of you uh, biology and AP biology students, please stay in the habit or start the habit of checking your school email. Because I know there's a feature on Google Classroom where I can send all of you an email in one fail swoop. Of course, I'll use Remind, but some of you are not on Remind. You, everybody has a Moore County Schools email, so I'll try to use that as much as possible. I will continue posting Quizlet vocabulary each week for my regular biology 